Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. This contest was made at catch weight, 20 minutes of wrestling, no rounds, two falls, two submissions, or a knockout to decide the winner. Red corner, ladies and gentlemen, from Dartford in Kent, Keith Hayward. And in the blue corner, ladies and gentlemen, from Peckham in London, British lightweight champion, Steve Ray. Our referee, Mr. Ken Joyce. So here for the main bout of the afternoon, a catch weight, 20 minutes duration, Keith Hayward from Dartford, Kent, 12 stone six, and Steve Gray, his opponent, the British lightweight champion at uh, 11 stone from Peckham, South East London. First round. This is the first session of a 20 minute duration contest, two falls to the side. Haywood with the stone and a half weight advantage here. And he's up against one of the fastest men in the business. to a head chancery. Ray with his pitch blacks and trunks and shock of hair, of course. And silver boots will help us identify the sign of this. side headlock. Causing so much trouble for headlock the stranglehold. a bit, but he got out of it. And the left one's not too good either, but it really looks very good right here. No cauliflower ears up to now, Steve Gray, surprisingly. Oh, 
A lot of people ask me why they have these catchweight contests when one man is two and a half heavier. Very, very often turns out to be an excellent contest. I think this is going to be no exception. The speed of Steve Gray, plus his tremendous experience, could quite easily outweigh the superior strength of his opponent. Attacking moves together for the first time. Really. All his previous efforts have been counters. Fifteen minutes to go. No score. Two falls. Two submissions for Nakhar to decide the winner here. Thought he was going for a posting. Getting ready to try and soak it up as much as he could, but it didn't arrive. There's the speed up there. Double handed wrist lever keeping that arm straight. That's quite down too early. Great way. Send him a telegram man. Almost paid for it.
He was a bit near the ropes to start it, Steve Bray, anyway. I don't know if it had been. Straight arm lift position. Of a lot into this. Only halfway. Ten minutes. Keeps forgetting, doesn't he? Full of apologies now, but uh, keeps going for his man to win. for the weakened leg. Yeah. Oh, lovely move by Hayward, though. Holding press and trouble for Gray here. He's got it. Hayward gets the first fall. In just 10 minutes, 57 seconds, Hayward gets the first pinfall. Fred Downs. Well, ladies and gentlemen, in, in, in the 11th minute of the contest, the first fall in favour, Keith Hayward. Well, this one, it's really expected. Hayward, uh, the stronger of the two, the heavier of the two, the taller of the two, but I wouldn't be at all surprised to see Steve Gray come back here. Let's see what happens in the second session. Steve Gray, second session. Time. Or so to go. Straight arm lift position again, Hayward. Remember Hayward leading by one for the more now. Hayward on the left there in the blue trunks. Gray tries one of those, Hayward. Same move, and Ken Joyce, the former European Willoway champion, <laughs> just the man to separate them if they run this move. That's better. Straight arm left. Four down. A little bit inaccurate, I think. Turn it, double turn on it, beautifully held. Can he hold the feet? Not quite. Folding press charge for Gray again. And he's got the weight right. He's got it. Great equaliser in 13 minutes, 58 seconds.
Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. In the 13th minute, an equalising fall to the British champion, Steve Gray. British lightweight champion going up a couple of weights to take on his opponent here today. One fall each now, more than five minutes left. Six way, final session. Final session. One fall each. He's got to be a little careful with the risks now. One mistake could cost him a bullet. Five minutes to go. Second time he's caught from trouble with that double hand face bar under the chair. Referee right there if he wants to submit. That's a sleeper. That's a sleeper. Gray's gone. He'll be back in a few seconds. Operates the sleeper. Referee stops the ball. He's trying another one. Yes, he'll go for another one if he can. He would. Yes, there it is again. The left arm on the right hand side of Gray's neck is doing it. Goes in the corner. Doing the damage. Yes, yeah, sleeper again. Yes, the arm's gone. Sleeper is on. And it's not going to work. Break the hole. Not illegal as such. That's why he's counting. But the referee will break it every time he sees it up. We can gray now. He'll stay out of trouble for a bit. And he'll come back. Oh, nice. Sidestep that beautiful. And Gray thinking of his surfboard again. There's one arm. Got both legs and one arm. Now can he get the left arm? He's got three minutes to go there. Three minutes to go. Got the other arm now. Kenny forces man right back over the top. He's there, uh, but he's through the road, so unfortunately, Gray didn't allow himself enough room for the submission hook hold finish. I see one or two people are shouting there, as you can hear. Unlucky there, Steve. What a bit of it. Should really face an open canvas for that. Surfboard again, he's allowed himself a little more room behind him. So that the ropes shouldn't interfere with this one if he can get his man up. Yes, and look round the check. He's got enough room to try it again. Can he get a submission from this? Can he get his man up there first? Yes, he's all the way there. There's the submission hold of that here. And the referee right there waiting for a submission. But still Hayward says no. Just one minute one left. Minute to go. One minute. And Steve with a shot, but now he will go holding press from the side. As the referee checks it, counts of one, one and a half. There. Both men will have to hurry to get a result here. Public 
warning for that. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee has given Haywood first public warning. Finally, the referee, Tom Joyce, had enough of Haywood attacking to her. 25 seconds to go. Both men very tired now, sweating profusely, giving an awful lot of energy to this bout. Especially Steve Gray, who's giving away so much weight. Eight seconds, seven, six, five, four, three, two, it's two, two one, It's a one for each draw. But what a great bout. Listen to the applause. Very much deserved from for both those men. Class wrestling about there. It's been a long time before we see much better than that.